Sean Dowling, who's in a South Huntsville neighborhood where a tree has fallen onto some power lines. And Sean, I actually just saw on Twitter somebody who lives on that road where you are saying she's been without power since three this morning. Good morning, Gina. That's very easy to believe. I looked around right and left. Every single light on the street is out without power. And the problem with this tree that fell, that's right behind me, this large tree that fell on the power lines, is that it has so many branches that it's splintered between the lines, causing them to bow quite a bit. But the good news, if there is one, is that the lines are dead right now. Huntsville Utilities out here in, are out here in full force. I talked to the crews just a while ago, and they said they're backing up their cherry picker and going around the way to try and cut down the tree from the other side. It's simply too dangerous to drive underneath it right now. But again, I talked to Huntsville Utilities representatives. They said they've got their best guy up there in the cherry picker in the video we uh, showed you and shot just five minutes ago. Again, they're backing up the trucks right now. This is on Todd Hill Road, not too far from the YMCA and about three minutes away from that first tree that fell down on Bailey Cove Road that I was at about 30 minutes ago. Again, that one fell into the roadway. It's since been chopped up into pieces and it's now been cleared off. They're hoping to do the same thing on Todd Hill Road in Southeast Huntsville and just get this tree off the power lines and restore power to everybody on the street. For now reporting live in South Huntsville, I'm Sean Dowling, 48 on your side.